happy we're here together. We're going to be talking about home fragrancing and decorating, two of my most favorite things to do, by the way. And I'm so happy we're here on uh, PZTV live. Um, we are going to continue the fun. We started PZTV in August, and everybody had a great time. It was very successful, and we got to see everybody out there, even though we couldn't be together, but we were having a good time. And today, we're going to keep it up. We are going to introduce to you today the most adorable, fun-loving fragrance promotion. So we're super exci excited about that. And we're going to show you some of our favorite holiday products that will kind of go with it. Um, and I just think it's like perfect timing that we're doing this because, you know, it's like another week or two we get to start decorating for the holidays. So tonight you're going to be shopping and placing orders tonight and this weekend. And Dominique and David are going to be working real hard and they're going to get it out as fast as they can. And you're going to have it at the house ready to go to help your holiday season start with your friends and family and decorating. So I think this is going to be a great day. Um, yeah, and yeah, speaking of that, so we started decorating this <laughs> stage, which has been a lot of fun. But it kind of got me in the mood a little bit early. So kind of already started decorating my house <laughs> and playing Christmas music for the last two weeks, which um, we'll see how long that lasts. But anyway, it's all good fun. So we're very excited by all that. Um, so today, I just want to thank anybody that is just joining us, um, joining Pink Zebra. And I know that you're going to love this product. You probably have smelled some sprinkles. Someone's kind of got you into that and enjoying those. Um, so thank you again for being here. And thank you for taking an interest in Pink Zebra. Um, Pink Zebra is such a, well, it's fun for me because Tom and I are the founders of Pink Zebra. And we are known for our sprinkle product. And sprinkles are these adorable uh, soft soy, proprietary blend of soft soy wax melts, basically. And they are just packed and loaded full of fragrance. Um, we love them. They're our signature item, as I said. But we have 64 fragrance that we have this catalog season. And actually, we've had 64 t every time we come out with adding, bring new seasonal in and dropping out some old ones. But there's plenty of fragrance. But the thing that we love about these tiny little wax beads, soy wax beads, is that you can mix them, too. So as you're melting them in your home, you can enjoy the fragrance as is. Or you can blend them, make your own fragrance if you want a little more vanilla or a little more cinnamon, whatever you decide, you can do that. So we really love those sprinkles. They're really great. Um, there's plenty of other products. We have some accessories that help you melt them and um, other home fragrance products that the ladies are going to tell you more about very soon because they're very excited over here. Um, but there's so much more to Pink Zebra than all the awesome product that we love. Uh, it has been Tom and I's passion since we've started nine years ago to bring change your lives, changing lives of people that enjoy and experience Pink Zebra. And we do that in lots of different ways. Um, obviously, in direct selling and when you're doing home parties, we've got all these great consultants that have made the decision to be an independent consultant and take the opportunity to have their own business. They're all over the United States and up in Canada and Puerto Rico. And oh my God, it's been such a fun trip and journey watching them all grow. You know, they're, they're enjoying the product, they're selling the product, they are going to events, they're having parties, they're creating these teams and communities within themselves. You guys are doing awesome. And I think the best part about it really for me is really hearing about all their stories and how they've really truly been affected and, and changed by Pink Zebra and the decisions that they're making and, and the friends that they have made. It's really wonderful. Um, and we look for other opportunities as well to change lives. So talked about our sprinkles. Um, they are a soft soy wax blend. And we're so proud to say that the, the soy wax that is in this blend comes directly from US farms. Um, they are not, it's not imported in, it's brought right in from the farms. Um, so we're supporting the farmer community and their family and then the community that they live in. So we're very proud of that. Um, as a matter of fact, all our fragrant products are made right here in the U.S. As a matter of fact, right here in Sugarland. I think this is like the little elf factory got going <laughs> on back there. <laughs> but we make all those products there and um, it just 
it just brings local jobs to the community again loving that um, us that made and changing communities and changing people's lives we love that impact um, and i think the other one that is very important um, that actually we've been doing since day one is our heroes program and the heroes program is our charitable program that basically supports single mothers and we are there to subsidize their daycare costs um, we think it's very important specifically for single moms um, you know they found them they're in a situation where they're trying to do it all on their own and women specifically um, make 81 cents to the dollar of a man so they've got a little bit of a different scenario there but there's no reason they shouldn't have their dreams fulfilled as well so we find it very important. We've had so many single mothers that have been truly, truly changed and affected by this. Because, um, you know, basically, if mama knows that the babies are happy and they're happy, having fun, and thriving, then mom can relax and she continue to become educated and fulfill her careers that she's been wanting. And when mama's happy, we're all happy. So we're super proud of our Heroes program. As a matter of fact, I would have to encourage all of you now. If you know a single mom or are a single mom, please go on our website and fill out that application. We, um, we uh, look at them every week, every day, and um, constantly adding new people into the community. And we just love it. We're very proud of it. So Pink Zebra, change fragrance, change lives. It's right there in our tagline. So we are ready to shop. Are you guys getting ready to shop? Let's do it. OK, so the shopping, I just got to make sure everybody's good. So you're watching this live, right? So that's a kind of good streaming thing going on. But you need to be on the website, too, on the shopping cart under the PZTV tab because all the products that they're specifically showing you tonight will be right under there just so it's really easy for you to find. They are also, if it's a continuing item, they'll be under the current tabs. But we just want to make it real easy for you just to kind of keep doing it. So if you're watching the live, you're going to see a little Shop Now button. And you just hit that button, and it's going to take you to the shopping cart, right to that PZ tab. And you scroll in, add to cart, go right back to that live stream, because you're not going to want to miss anything. There's so many cute things going on. Um, let's see what else. Um, oh, some fun products. It's seasonal, so while supplies last, that always is a factor. Um, we've got a few more weeks before uh, I guess, you know, holiday and shipping and all that kind of starts to slow down a little bit. So don't hesitate. If you find something that you love, jump on that. Um, and there are a couple items that we want to make sure that everybody gets a chance to, to buy. So we limited those to two per person, and it would be to customers only. So all that will be on the detail of the shopping cart, and you'll see what that is. And um, I think that's it. The ladies are ready to tell you more about all the fun promotions. Are you guys ready? I am. Okay, you guys ready? ready? We're ready. Let's Take it do away. It. Hi guys, I'm Brittany, creative director here at Pink Zebra. Hi, I'm Danielle Richardson, and I am the fragrance developer here at Pink Zebra. We are so excited to be with you guys tonight. Every year we try really hard to think of something really fun and creative to give you guys this time of the year. We've done everything from seasonal cartons, exclusive fragrance packs, 12 days of Christmas, but we knew this year had to be extremely special, and we also had to include our super clean line that we introduced just this April. So we came up with this fun promotion we're so happy to share with you, the six Christmas elves. It's yes. so cute, and I'm gonna read you guys a story. You have to read them the story. <laughs> it's adorable. Okay, so the story goes that Santa has six little helpers who make magic come alive. First, there is Alabaster Snowball. This elf is not only the smartest elf, but also in charge of the naughty and nice list. So be sure to stay on his good side. Bushy Evergreen is the elf known for the greatest inventions, creating Santa's toy making machine. He cheerfully spends his days making toys that he knows will put a smile on all the kids' faces. Peppermint Sticks is Santa's protector, guarding the secret location of Santa's workshop to make sure no secrets get out. Also, get on his good side too, and he might sneak you a peppermint or two. Shinny up a tree is the oldest of elves, but also the most devoted with the biggest heart. He loves the Christmas season the most. Sugar Plum Mary is the tiniest elf, head of sweet treats and all of this season's yummies. Our last elf, 
One Horse Open Sleigh is known for creating Santa's sleigh that delivers all the toys every year and makes sure everyone knows of this accomplishment too. Together, these elves add jolly to the Christmas season. Isn't that the cutest little I story? I love it. It's, I'm anticipated. I can't even imagine. I'm so excited. Everyone is so excited. So I'm just going to jump Let's right jump in. Let's jump right in. Um, so that adorable little story that Brittany read to you is your Six Elves promotion, which is six exclusive fragrance. Um, these fragrances were inspired by those six little elves, their names, the jobs they have to help get Christmas ready. Um, I'm going to share with you today the fragrance notes included in each of these fragrances and what a note is, is what makes up that fragrance. What are the smells that you're smelling? So we're going to talk a little bit about that. And then I'm also going to share with you some amazing recipes that I have created using core fragrances um, that are available online as well as with the um, elf fragrances, your exclusive elf fragrances. Yeah. So, um, there's a few different formats that we have here in front of us. Um, so the, each elf is going to come in four individual formats. You have your 3.75 ounce jar bag. So that's the same um, size as your jar of sprinkles. I have to talk about the label or the Look packaging. Look how cute. So the packaging is that's a little transparent opening. So that is actually the sprinkles, the color. You can see them moving around in there. And then the back has the cute little story that we just read. So again, this packaging is all exclusive. So we're super so excited cute. about this. So um, it has your 3.7 ounce, 75 ounce jar bag, your um, 3.75 fluid ounce bottle of soaks, and then you have your four pack of mini hand sanitizer, super clean, and then your super clean antibacterial hand soap. And then we also created two bundles, which makes um, this an easy gift to mm -hmm. give. Um, so you have over here your super clean bundle, over here is your super <laughs> clean bundle, and then on Brittany's side, you have your home fragrance bundle, which includes the sprinkle and the soak. And we really did this very intentional for you guys to be able to shop and make it, you know, worthwhile and perfect for the, the upcoming season. You know, during Thanksgiving and Christmas, I'm sure some of us will have family and friends over mm -hmm. for the holidays. So we really wanted to give you something that you can use to make your house smell wonderful with our fragrance, but also use our super clean products to feel clean and safe during the holidays, too. So we really do have something for everyone. We do. You ready to jump into our Let's elves? Let's do it. Okay, so what you have here in front of you is your first elf. This is Alabaster Snowball. Um, and this elf is not only the smartest elf, um, but is in charge of the naughty and nice list. So be sure to stay on his good side. So this Alabaster Snowball, guys, oh my gosh. It smells so good. This has notes of frost and sandalwood. I can smell um, it from What here. a great everyday fragrance, those notes. The frost and the sandalwood makes it um, a more masculine kind of, um, uh, masculine like deeper fragrance mm -hmm. than you would think of like a frosty, crisp like peppermint. It's more on the masculine, masculine. deep side, yeah, this which really everybody good. loves a little bit of that. They do. And if you're new here, I'm sure you're wondering what you do with sprinkles. So as Kelly was saying, sprinkles are pink zebras format of wax fragrance. We have two ways to use them, super easy peasy. Our first way that you use sprinkles is a simmer pot. I have here our Mr. Snowman simmer pot that is just so cute and seasonal. We love him. One thing we love about our products is that they're so detailed. This item is hand painted and includes a dish that has a cute little top hat design, really bringing that whimsical Christmas straight to your house. The simmer pot is very easy to use all you do is pour the sprinkles on top and then turn the switch and your house is fragranced. And I just love the size of the simmer pots. Mm -hmm. It makes it such an easy um, piece to put on a counter, nestle in with your other home decor items, yeah. but you're fragrancing your home kind of in a secret way. Right. But someone like something like the Mr. S um, Snowman Simmer Pot, you wouldn't want to hide right. him, so he, keep he him out. He needs to be seen <laughs> for sure. Our next warming device is a simmering light. This is also very easy to use. Whenever you purchase a simmering light, you will receive a base with the light bulb, a warming shade, and a dish. We have here our deer simmering light, and this one I love because it is so transitional. You can have it out for Christmas, but then keep it out all winter long, and it's the perfect home decor piece, whether your home is a lodgy decor style, or even more modern, or even traditional also. It really fits all different types of home decor. It really does, because like you said, it's a great transitional if you're someone who maybe keeps out winter a little bit right. longer. You totally can 
or if you have that rustic kind of decor in your home all year, what a great piece to put in there. Right, and this is also very easy to use. All you do is pour your sprinkles on top, and then the cord, not, the cord has a little switch that you just turn on and off. And the great thing about these, like Danny said, is they act as a little lamp, too. It does. It's a lamp, but you are fragrancing your home. Kind of secret. Secret. <laughs> <laughs> but you won't want to keep it a secret. No, it's too cute to keep a secret. <laughs> it's too cute. <laughs> so I do want to make a recipe blend. I yeah. told you guys that I was going to make some blends using our L fragrances, blended together with um, some core fragrances. So. Like Brittany was saying, these little tiny beads make your um, make it super easy to blend as many fragrances as you want mm -hmm. together. So I want to blend in this cute <gasps> Mr. Snowman it. Simmer Pot. So the first recipe that I have created is three fragrances. So you can blend one <gasps> fragrance, two fragrances, 12 fragrances, any any that, amount of fragrances. That, that's the great thing about sprinkles mm -hmm. is you really can't make a recipe that's your own. There's no right or wrong way to blend. You just find what you like, mix it together, and you mm -hmm. have your own fragrance. That's and just we're gonna so fun. We're going to show you a little secret on how to do it. So if you feel a little scared to blend, you can <laughs> we'll help test you out. it out before. <laughs> so this blend that I'm going to make is going to have your aspen pine sprinkles, your winter woods, and we're going to use alabaster snowball, your elf number one. Um, to make this recipe. So first you have your aspen pine. This is fresh cut Christmas pine mm. with clove and orange. It is Christmas in a jar and you may hear us say that a couple oh times. Oh my goodness, this <laughs> smells just like a Christmas tree. So good. So we can put that one in. Both of those fragrances have been top sellers yes. for years. It's been in the line the whole time. Aspen yeah. pine and Both winter woods. So, good. so our winter woods is a dry cedar, sandalwood, Patchouli, a tiny little bit of leather, really not noticeable, amber, and spice. Ooh. But the spice is not your cinnamon spice. It's kind of a, um, a warmer spice, not your red hot spice. Mm -hmm. But um, they are both fragrances that have been in our winter line for a very, very long time. They're great. And just a side note, too, we made this really easy for you guys. So if you are shopping right now, you can go to the Shop Now button that's on the side of the screen, and then we actually put all of these core fragrances in the same category as the promotion, so you can buy it all at once. You can shop the recipe. <laughs> so, okay, and then our alabaster snowball. So, Britt, you want to hand me yeah, that aspen pine? So. If you have a friend or you have three hands, you <laughs> there's no one has three hands. So you gotta find a um, friend. You can mix these. You just smell all together, and then you can decide. Maybe I want to put a little bit more aspen pine. Maybe I want to put in a little more winter wood. So you let me know. What do you think? Mm, this is hard because I love alabaster snowballs so much. I think I want to put a little of the aspen pine. Okay. Okay. And then a little. Well, maybe more than a little <laughs> of the winter woods. You can't mess this up. And a know? really good tip, too, is you can actually, if you do have a jar, you can use the cap as a good measurement, measurement. to measure out a cap full. And then... I want to put a lot of I, I think one. I agree with you on this <laughs> one. We're going to put a lot of alabaster snowball in here. Let's pour this baby out. There you go. Oh, my goodness. Okay. So just wait. Uh-oh. I called this... Recipe. What'd you name it? Winter Dreams. Do you Yum? Mix, do you mix it oh up? Oh my goodness. Yeah, you can do a little mix. This smells just can like a winter can dream. Zoom in on the mix. So that winter dream recipe used your aspen pine, your no. winter woods, and your alabaster snowball. I don't know if you can see it in there. You can see how we mix them up. And the great thing about our sprinkles is that they they're colored, so you really can see how much you're putting of each fragrance and make it to your liking. It's so pretty, too. The <laughs> colors are. So that's your winter dream recipe. So good. Um, so um, all of our core fragrances, which would be your aspen pine and your winter woods, those are available in your catalog and online, are also available in a 16-ounce carton, um, which is over here by Brittany. You can see the different sizes we have to offer. So this, if you have a favorite fragrance, stock up on it and get the 16 ounce. And so you can get that in any fragrance that's in a jar that you're going to see today. Mm -hmm. Um, so, like Britt said, along with this Winter Dreams, any product we talk about is going to be in that PZ TV shopping tab. Super mm -hmm. easy. It's going to be in the order we're talking about it. So, follow we made along, it easy. <laughs> shop with us, and we're so excited. <laughs> okay, so I think we're ready to show them how else they can use this fragrance because, again, remember, all your elves come in soaks, too. In soaks. So. Soaks are your liquid format of your sprinkle fragrance. So 
just like you blend it, we blended our sprinkles, you can blend our soaks. So it is the liquid format you can see right here. Um, it, it is skin safe, it's fabric safe, alcohol free, pet friendly, and so much more. Um, there's so many ways to use soaks, you guys. So I'm going to show you a few of those ways, um, as well as showing you a little bit about blending your soaks. So let's start off with the most obvious, your reed diffuser. And Britt can talk a little bit about that yeah. while I'll be mixing up a little recipe. So while she's here. making the recipe, I'm going to talk about our reed diffuser because I love it. This is one of our core products called our Light Natural Reeds. These reeds are so great for any place that you don't have a plug or even a small space like a bathroom or lots of our um, customers and consultants love to put them on their desk in their office. They're great because again, they're plug free and they're really easy to fragrance. All you do is pour your soaks in there and then you have fragrance that goes up through the reeds. The great thing about our light natural reeds is that you can use the top and twist it back on and refresh your reeds super easy. It's also great for storing and great for refreshing. So again, great for any small space, super easy to use. It's almost like having no mess, no fuss fragrance. And then the reed color is this beautiful, traditional, natural wood color that will really match any home decor style. We did that intentional so that it fits into any type of home decor and just really can work how you want it to. These are great for little kids rooms, bathrooms, kitchens, again, any place where you don't want to plug in fragrance, our soaks for sure is, is the way to go. Soaks are my favorite. They I'm are sorry, favorite. I'm over you here just soaks. like doing a little bit of blending. <laughs> so that was great. So I started blending up my um, Winter Dreams recipe, which was the Aspen Pine, Winter Woods, and your Alabaster Snowball in our reed diffuser. Um, what I love about this is it's a great vessel to do all your blending in there. Mm -hmm. You can just put this down, do all the all the blending all concoctions the blending. you want to do, um, as little as and or as much soaks as you would like. And Britt can show you. She was talking about how you do the flipping. It is um, super easy to do it. So, so I filled my soaks into this. Twist is that. twist the cap on, and then look, you guys, it goes on just like that. You can refresh your reeds whenever you want to and then you can open it back up and your reeds are fragranced and it's no mess and no fuss. And I can smell that from here, it smells so good. I know, and what's great is, I, I don't know if you mentioned the store, you can store, yep. the, you can store your reeds when you put this back on, um, if maybe you wanna switch out your fragrance for the weekend or right. whatever you want to do. It's a great storage. So the next thing we have, okay, so I'm gonna put this guy put over this here. Away. We'll, we'll show switch. some more is Soaps our products. adorable little wall hug. Love this thing. Um, mm -hmm. This is our next Just Add Soaks decor item, um, our wall hug, which is a plug-in diffuser. Mm -hmm. um, it's great for any small spaces, your hallways, bathroom. It's a slim, lightweight design that allows you to freshen any space 24-7 using Pink Zebra soaks. So on the side of this is um, a great little logo that's embossed. It's probably very hard to see on here, but I'll try to show you. Make see the embossment. So there's this tiny little tail, which is Paisley's, our Pink Zebra logo's tail, comes to the front just enough to see that as the fill line. That is a good indication as to where to fill your soaks. Um, just a cute little a tip. cute little tip. <laughs> so, but the one thing that we love about our wall hug is that it was designed to fit your home. Of course, on the back of the wall hug, you have a plug, but we made this customizable by making this plug able to be turned. So you can see that the wall hug plug turns, and it does that so it's able to fit any plug in your home. Some people have vertical plugs in their bathroom where traditional plug-ins don't fit. This one will work because you can turn it to make it fit in your home. These are great to put in places like an office where you don't want to put a simmer pot or a simmering light on your desk or even somewhere where you have a hallway to allow that fragrance to be perfect as your friends and family come to your house for the first time. It's just great to put into a space. But you know what? I what? love our wall hug, don't get me wrong. <laughs> um, but soaks get even better. They do. They really we have do. more, that's not it. They do, I'm gonna put this over here. Okay. Okay, so as you were seeing when we were doing our reads, um, and that picture you saw of the wall hug, we used our soaks in a, let me, under my, my little, we got secrets down my little here. gift <laughs> box down here. Um, we were using this squirt cap that you saw here, I'll do it over here by the reed diffuser, um, that you saw us squeezing it in there and it comes out the little spout like that. It's wonderful. But there's also a second way to do this. 
and it every box of soaps, every bottle of soaps, must I say, comes with a second attachment, which is your spray atomizer. Mm -hmm. This is not just for your elves. This is no. all your core products. We'll have this great little spray guy on here, and I have this one. I am not ready. <laughs> I have this one actually set up. So what this allows is for, for a it. room spray, a body spray. Look at how light and mist that is. So good. <laughs> and if you like it enough, you could spray it on yourself because it's right. skin safe, fabric safe. You can spray it anywhere. I have a little secret. I use our soaks to spray my dog Parker. <laughs> it is like his doggy cologne. All my friends laugh at me because my dog no. smells so good. He wears sweaters. He, he wears sweaters. He, he has cologne. cologne. He's good to go. But really, you guys, Soaks is a great product, as Danielle was saying. It's skin safe, it's fabric safe. You can use it as a room spray, which during the holidays, you know, it's great to just refresh your room mm -hmm. sometimes, but also for your dogs. But we also have some more products that Soaks are great to use mm -hmm. on. For example, our Go Cards. Danielle is pointing to our Snowflake Go Cards that are great for this holiday season. They're so cute because you can put them in your car and have Christmas with you all the on time in the mirror or That's you can good. even put them on places like a Christmas tree. We have a little Christmas tree up here but one DIY project that we love to tell our customers and consultants to do is to grab those go cards, spray your favorite soaked, soaked fragrance mm -hmm. on them and use them as little Christmas ornaments and it just makes your Christmas tree smell even better. Yeah, because if you're a house that maybe has an artificial Christmas tree, you can still have the great smells of Christmas <laughs> with that and this is your snowflake go-kart pack that comes in four so you have all these cute little different shapes of um, snowflakes and you can see all four of them this guy was hiding behind those would be <laughs> so cute as present <gasps> a gift tag. Gift tags. if you want to be the extra person that has like me a, yes Brittany <laughs> would do this um, a fragranced package that you give yeah. someone you can put this as a gift tag and maybe write their names on that that's such a and cute idea spray and then do that for your spray Christmas gifts this year Thank you so much. <laughs> um, okay, so are we ready to move Elf on? Elf number two. Elf I think, number I think two. they want to hear about it. Elf number two, guys, we have here is Bushy Evergreen, and he is the elf known for the greatest inventions, creating Santa's toy-making machine. He cheerfully spends his day making toys that he knows will put a smile on all the kids' faces. I am dying this. to smell this one. But she evergreen. I snagged it up before they could even get a shot. I didn't even get to smell it. She stole it. From Sorry. Me. <laughs> I get a little crazy sometimes when it comes to fragrance. But this um, bushy evergreen has notes of cranberry and juniper. Such great staple fragrances. The cranberry oh brings goodness. such a brightness to your traditional juniper, mm -hmm. um, making a little bit of an interesting, fun fragrance, but still very holiday. Mm, that one's um, fun. This fragrance is so versatile meaning you can blend so much with this um, and give it just a little bit of Christmas spirit, <laughs> any of your fragrances. And I actually created two recipes with this one. Um, your first recipe is I actually blended together your elf number one. Where did that one go, Brett? Elf number one is right, right here. here. Okay. Um, I blended elf number one alabaster snowball with elf number two because they're buddies, so they wanted to hang out together. Um, <laughs> Bushy evergreen and made a little recipe. Oh my goodness, what'd you call this one? I call this one holiday comfort. Mm, and I called so it that. Good. Um, that is the thing about blending fragrances, even naming them, whatever. It is unique to you. Whatever you want, whatever you feel, that's what fragrance does to somebody is it entices a memory, maybe a feeling. Mm -hmm. um, Anything, literally right. anything. So when I was naming this, I was thinking how um, Alabaster Snowball kind of gave me a um, rusticy feel. Ooh. I don't know why. I just felt rusticy. Felt and right. Then, <laughs> and then um, <laughs> the um, bushy evergreen was very holiday for me. So that's how I came yeah. up with. Um, Come, what did I call it? I'm sorry. It's okay. <laughs> she called it something cute, but I really I got so into talking about what I'm inspiration <laughs> when I was thinking about other names oh. I could call it. <laughs> that really comfort. That really is the great thing, though, with fragrances. We've had so many customers and consultants that email us and tell us, oh my goodness, this fragrance reminds me of my grandma. Mm -hmm. It reminds me of being home for the holidays. So fragrance really does bring back those good memories that just puts a smile on your face. It and does. who doesn't want to create a fragrance that they, they love, for And sure. it's yours. It's right. unique. And with pink zebra, you can do that. <laughs> so, okay, I won't make, the, I won't mess this one up. So, okay, your, got second, it. <laughs> your second recipe that I created with you is your bushy evergreen elf number two with cup of jolly. This cup of jolly is um, a fragrance available online in your catalog. Cup of jolly is bayberry, 
pomegranate tea, mm. sugar plum, and oh, ivy. Smell. Such a bright, fun fragrance. And I blended that with the bushy evergreen and this blend that I created. You gotta smell these two together. I gotta smell them. I, these mm. two, I called this one just Grinchy. Oh my goodness, this is so cute. I'm guessing you did that because of the colors. You're so, you know me so well. I know you. <laughs> it's because it has these fun tones of green and you know, that's what I was saying when it comes to naming a fragrance. You literally can come up with them from anything. You can. So For this recipe, I can for sure see putting it in our other seasonal items that we have, such as our reindeer simmer pot and our jolly simmer pot. Both of these items, again, are very seasonal but very different. The one thing I want to call out first is that they are larger simmer pots, which really allows for you to put more fragrance in them. The second thing is all the detail. Our reindeer simmer pot is a really clean, modern design. So it's nice and clean and white, but then we added a little fun by giving the reindeer a little embossing and making it look like he has a little sweater on. And then we added some cute little ornaments on him just to make him a little bit more festive. Our Jolly Simmer Pot is a very traditional red and white simmer pot that says Jolly and then has an embossed peppermint on it. And then we even made that even more fun and put the, made the inside of the dish printed so it has some color too. The great thing about our products is you can use them with sprinkles or you can just have them out as is. Here you can see we nestled two simmer pots together and they had a really cute holiday display that's just perfect for Christmas. It's I think adorable. that's like the cutest little gift giving it thing. It is. You know, it's the perfect price. It's adorable. The timeless. They'll take it out every year. Right. Right? Right. You, you, you could um, for sure pair one of these simmer pots with one of these elves and you have a, a little Christmas gift already. I know. I'm already sitting here thinking of my next recipe. <laughs> so when I see that jolly simmer pot, I think of my peppermint kisses recipe. Ooh, what's that? So your peppermint kisses <laughs> is um, a blend of two fragrances. Your first one is your elf number three, which is in front <gasps> of us, and flannel blanket, which is a fragrance from the catalog. Um, but I want to start with talking about elf number three, um, which is your peppermint sticks. Um, this is Santa's mm. protector, guarding the secret location of so good. Um, Santa's workshop to make sure no secrets get out. Also, probably get on his good side and he'll sneak you a peppermint or two. So, what is a holiday without a peppermint fragrance, really? Right. Oh Smell my this. goodness. But the really interesting thing about this one is that it's not just your typical mm -hmm. peppermint, it actually smells like a peppermint cupcake. It so is. For sure, our customers that already have Yum. our peppermint from the core catalog, mm -hmm. you're gonna love this. I can assure you, it's totally different than our peppermint in the core just catalog. Just as good, but totally different. Totally it different. It has these buttercream notes, but also your so peppermint. So good, I wanna if keep smelling. Peppermint, but you could <laughs> mix them together and add more peppermint. You totally can if you just <laughs> want the peppermint Peppermint smells. for everyone. Peppermint for everyone. <laughs> Um, okay, so like we said, this has uh, your peppermint sticks. Elf number three is a notes of peppermint and buttercream. Um, but I created a recipe that was your peppermint sticks, elf number three, with flannel blanket. And um, like I said, flannel blanket was a fragrance available to you in the winter catalog. Love this flannel blanket. Um, such a cozy, just cozy fragrance, guys. This has sandalwood light leather notes again, but really this warm flannel blanket. It's just a feeling fragrance. And you blend these two together, and this is such a cozy, but it's so cozy and so fresh. Like, it's interesting how you can blend two things together. It completely changes um, what the fragrance feels. Um, uh, where was I? So for that one, I can for sure see putting that fragrance in some of our peppermint gingerbread house accent shades. This is such a great fragrance that's just so good and smells so yummy. So I'm gonna show you guys what we have here. Our Peppermint Gingerbread House Accent Shade that is, again, a seasonal item. The one thing we love about our gingerbread houses is that our customers and consultants throughout the years have collected some from the past and bought the new ones and made these super cute little gingerbread villages. Here we have our Peppermint Gingerbread House that's in our, court, our catalog right now, but we have it layered with our candy gingerbread house accent shade. These two together really make the cutest little village. We paired our peppermint gingerbread house accent shade with glossy white and it really makes it glow even more. This peppermint gingerbread house is taller than our ones we've had in the past that really just makes it stand out and it becomes a great standalone piece. 
We added some glitter on the outside to really make it glow too. I am like sitting here looking at that glossy white. I'm sorry. I'm like, it's okay, we I'm switched. Like, Let me in here. <laughs> um, this glossy white simmering light is such a great piece to have. Um, it looks good under every single of one of your winter uh, accent shades, but even just transitioning into the seasons um, of spring, summer, you can't go wrong with this. So this glossy white, um, I'm gonna try to flip it on and off so you guys can maybe see. Um, that was the gingerbread house. It's the one behind the box. Behind the box. There, there go. we go. So you can see how white and shiny it is, and then when we turn it on, how glowing it is. And you see it here underneath the gingerbread house. Like, it really just brings this thing to life. You can see all these fun sparkles in it. It looks like somebody's home cooking up something good. And then underneath our um, adorable Snow Girl accent shade. Um, she has these great pink accessories, and then, um, Underneath you have that uh, glossy white simmering light that really just shines, bringing her to cute little white body to life. And then you have the snowflake um, cutouts that just allow them to really, really glow. Just great pieces, love them. Oh my goodness, the one thing about glossy white is it really works everywhere. We have it over here also with our train accent shade. I just wanna call out, you're probably wondering, why you see three train accent shades up here. And we want to show you guys how you can use our accent shades in different ways. You can see right here, we have two train accent shades under simmering lights, and we use them as bookends on a mantle. How cute is that? Yeah. <laughs> we also have one that isn't under an accent shade, just to show you guys the detail and to point out different ways you can use it. This item is a really cute train that is a traditional high gloss red color. We made it even better by adding some beautiful gold detailing that I want to point out is all hand painted. Of course, there's lots of cutouts so fragrance can shine through, but even by itself, it's just such a cute item. It's so nostalgic, and you can use this just as is, decorating your house for the front. holiday season. Look how cute the front is. So cute. cute. I love this train accent shade, and like Brittany said, I just love how um, our accent shades can go from being this great fr item that's fragrancing your home over a simmering light and making this light, but also can just be a standalone piece. Um, but it is great when you get to add that fragrance to it, how much it brings um, it to life more, you know? So when you're pointing out that train accent shade, I'm thinking of the Polar Express, that movie. It's a traditional holiday movie. That is me and my sister's all-time favorite movie. I can never forget when we were younger. Um, you guys know the part where they're singing the hot chocolate song and they're all running up and down the <laughs> train and they're having so much fun throwing hot chocolate all around? We would just like rewind that part, rewatch it. That was our favorite part. So I'm just imagining doing that train accent shade um, with our hot cocoa sprinkles, which is a fragrance from our Ooh. core winter catalog. Um, it is cocoa, milk, um, and marshmallow cream. And it is crazy to oh me. Oh, my goodness. The, when I say the layers of this fragrance really you're smelling the powdered cocoa like before you make it, but then you still smell the warmth of the milk and then that mm. marshmallow is literally melting on top and you can Yum. smell all of that. I want to smell now, you made it sound too good. It is good and it's so good that you're gonna want to get it in your oh. um, 16 ounce carton of this, but she's hosting a Thanksgiving again. So um, I'm gonna bring this to her as like a little thank you. Oh my gosh, that's such a cute gift. And speaking of cute gifts, we have some other items that are great gifts too. Always. This past October, we launched what we're calling our Happy Thoughts Collection. This is a collection of cute simmer pots that has sentimental sayings and feelings, <laughs> and it is really great for gifts at a $35 price point. But even better, when you buy one, you truly are changing a life because they are made here in the USA. How fun. I love these things. They're kind of like a little um, card you could just send someone for mm -hmm. a little reminder that um, they're your hero or just some other fun things. You can go check them out online. We have some more. Yeah, and that one for sure would be super cute for a little boy's room. Mm -hmm. But then for a little girl's room, we have something different. That's a cute, mm -hmm. super cute gift. Here we have our Mommy and Me Paisley. Our Paisley plush is kind of fun because she's been around for a while, but we love to revamp her and make her different. This year we have a Mommy and Me Paisley, and what we did was kind of did two Paisleys in one, so Mommy even has a little Paisley with her. 
The Mommy and Me Paisley is great for consultants and for customers. For customers, she's just super fun to have, but for consultants, we put a little pocket on the back that fits a business card, so you're able to put this out on your table, at, in your office, if you're having a PZ Live with your favorite consultants, or even at a trade show, out on your table. And then the little Paisley is just fun to have. Do you remember, um, sorry, I'm like interrupting it's you, okay. but when there was the um, Paisley, uh, Where's Paisley, and all these consultants and customers were doing traveling with Paisley, doing all these fun videos and pictures with Paisley. She's done everything. I mean, she's skied, she's tanning. <laughs> Paisley's been she's everywhere. Cooking. She's been I'm, all over the I'm world. Jealous. All over the world. <laughs> so they would do this fun thing that they would um, have take all the pictures of her doing things. So it reminded me just now when you were talking, um, Elf on a Shelf, <gasps> which is that tradition that oh, parents do with their kids. So you could play um, Paisley on a shelf. How cool. How cute is that? That's a really cute That's DIY cute where Paisley put Paisley on the shelf. Another DIY that we have, or not a DIY, but kind of a Christmas mm -hmm. tip, is all of these super, all of these elves come with a four pack of mini hand sanitizers. How cute are these to use for stocking suppers this holiday season? Like the cutest little gift. I mean, everyone loves them. I want to call out that our super clean products are pH balanced. So they really leave your hands feeling soft and clean but not dry. So these are great for stocking suppers or even as a teacher's gift. Mm -hmm. It is, and you, like you had said earlier, um, with all the holiday gatherings you have going on, um, it's great to just have these ready to go whenever yeah. you may be going shopping, if stores in are your open, purse. Ready, in your purse. Right. Um, like she said, we have our super clean bundle, which has that great four pack with your bottle of soap. So what a great addition to um, your guest bathroom sink. Mm -hmm. Um, or your kitchen bathroom, right. hallway bathroom. Right, and can we just look at the packaging on the soap? The really fun thing I think uh -huh. we did with this promotion was we took the packaging all the way through. So you get uh -huh. this cute little bag that has the elf and the story on the back, and then you can see the little transparent window is the elf hat, but then we even took it up a notch and put those same little elf and Q packaging on the soap and even on the he's, hand sanitizer he's dancing and around. the soaks. He's dancing around the <laughs> so soap. who that wouldn't just, want that it out? It adds to the little decor in the kitchen right. or the bathroom. You know, <laughs> the, the little things. The it, makes you yeah. it makes me happy. It's the it little things. things. <laughs> You're right. So what we're showing off right here is elf they number know. four. Is your shinny up a tree is your elf number four, you guys. The names um, are adorable. He is the <laughs> oldest of elves but the most devoted with the biggest heart. He loves the Christmas season the most. So Aww. this is basically me because I love the Christmas season this, the this most. This elf is Danny for sure. <laughs> Shinny up a tree. So love this fragrance. Shinny up a tree is notes of maple and wood. Two must have, two must have fragrances smell. for this season all in one. Mm. So that's there so you go. Good. So rich and sweet. It is, it so, is. so good. And that's yeah. what I was about to say is together they balance each other out so well. Right. Um, it is not this syrupy maple-y no. and then too overpowering with the wood together. Right. It just balances. It makes it such a good right. fragrance for your home. It's not overpowering. I love the color of these two. They're, they, they match the fragrances really well. Nice. <laughs> um, but I, of course, created a recipe with this one. Always got to do that. Um, and what I blended with our Shinny Up a Tree is our Fireside Vanilla, which mm. is oh a great fragrance in our core Have catalog. To smell that. This Fireside Vanilla is notes of smoky vanilla combined with bourbon, cedarwood, and patchouli. This is a favorite mm. among so many customers and consultants. Um, mm. It's been mm. in the line for such a long time, but together, what'd you call this? Cuddle by the Fire. Aww. Oh my goodness, this is such a cute recipe. Thank you. And Fireside Vanilla <laughs> for sure is a favorite among all of our customers right now and that is actually one that is available as a soak mm -hmm. and is a great soaks product. I love to use the soak of the Fireside Vanilla around this time of year for a room spray. It really just makes me feel like I'm getting close to the holidays and getting in that holiday spirit and it really is just so great. Again, our soaks are amazing because you can use them in lots of ways mm -hmm. from a room spray to a dog spray like I do or even on on you and in your car and just, I was just gonna anywhere say, fireside vanilla would be one that i would spray on myself like it mm -hmm. is kind of, it's not perfumey so i don't right. want to make it sound that way but it's kind of like a unisex perfume it's kind of like that masculine makes it feminine doable you wood, know in a way i actually travel with that one because you i do? love like if you're in a hotel or somewhere you can just spritz it around and it just brings the 
home fragrancing into the house and mm -hmm. right. takes care of any musty old room yeah. or whatever. Another good idea if you're traveling this season, pick up these elves and put them in your travel bags with you there to go. You go. Yeah. Take, take them the with you. Take the elves with you. And Paisley. <laughs> she We're traveling <laughs> elves now. <laughs> no, I was actually about to call out <laughs> Dana. So y'all know Dana. She was on our PZ TV when we watched the fall catalog, a cons uh, direct executive director yeah. of American Zebra, and Probably she awesome. is obsessed with, with soaks. fireside vanilla <laughs> soaks. Fireside vanilla, <laughs> Not yeah. just any soak. <laughs> Sprays it all over herself. <laughs> oh my gosh, sorry Dana, I just called you out. <laughs> I, would do the same, I would do the same thing, I love it. Okay, we're getting there. Number five. Elf number five, Ooh. drum roll. Da -da -da. Sugar Plum Mary, <gasps> guys. Well, the last elf was her favorite, and this elf is my favorite. Because she's you. She's, she's the me. tiniest of elves, head <laughs> of sweet treats, and all the season's yummies. Um, this Sugar Plum Mary, guys, has your notes of berry and sugar cane in it, and you can't go wrong with either one of those no, fragrances. Sure. Who does not love a good berry and some sugar, right? <laughs> my gosh. That sounds amazing, just as is. It is. Oh my god. And that's goodness. okay too, right? right? You don't even need to mix this one. I mean, you for sure you don't need to mix do that, any of these, but this smells so good why not just have by a little itself. Fun. Okay, so for this one, like, what'd you do? What, what'd you do? I want to know. I know okay. they want to know. Okay, so this one, I got a little crazy, guys. So I blended three fragrances together, and what I did <gasps> was cranberry and spiced tangerine, which yeah. are two fragrances available from your winter catalog, with our elf number five, Sugar Plum Mary. Um, your cranberry is <laughs> true sweet tart cranberry. Um, also, just such a great basic fragrance. I don't want to say basic, like it's just a good fragrance to have if you're it's blending around. Um, and then you have your spice mm. tangerine, zesty tangerine with your classic holiday spices. Mm. This smells like, you know when people make um, that uh, Tomas. tea, what's that tea stuff they put on the stove? Apple cider? Uh, like a cider? Apple cider? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> like a cider stuff? they put on the stove, but then it actually makes the whole house smell like it. That's what this kind I of smell smells like. I want to smell now. I want hot Don't, cocoa. You I can't make cider. fun of me and then smell my sweet I want everything you're talking about. So then, of course, I mix that with our Sugar Plum Mary. I'll help you. Thank you. I got to remind Do myself. Do you like it? Yeah. Do you like it? Oh, this one's really, it's interesting. It's, it's very unique. Bright. It's, a, it's a bright, happy not your traditional Christmas mm -mm. blends, but more of a bright, happy one. And it's one. good to have, well, okay, so I named this one Merry Mixer. So cute. Um, and it's nice to have a little mix-up of, you sometimes have these holiday fragrances that are so heavy, woody, pine. You're like, I need a little bit of something different. Right. This there is for go. sure different. A little bit of berry, a little bit of mm. brightness for your holiday. That's, that's good. So don't be afraid, though, because Sugar Plum Mary, <laughs> don't be afraid of her. <laughs> she, um... This ber berry notes mix so well with wood notes and those masculine masculine notes. So I did something a little interesting, unexpected. What did you do? Dare you to try it? Is your sugar plum Mary with chopped woods? And chopped woods is a fragrance also available from your winter catalog. Um, and I mix these two together, and this is such a romantic, but deep and interesting fragrance. Uh, love it. That is so good. And the really great thing about that one is because it is so traditional, you could really mix it with some other accessories that we have, like our snowmen. I want to show you guys what we have set up right here because I think it's perfect for our snowmen lovers. We have here are the snowman accent shade. This is a larger ceramic piece that is just so pretty and traditional. It has your traditional red and green coloring. Again, all hand painted. He's super cute with his accessories, like his top hat and his scarf, and then his little buttons allow for the light to glow so pretty. This one is a $50 price point, so it would be great for anyone that loves snowmen. I want to show you guys how to put an accent shade on. It's really simple. You see under here we have our simmering light. So we have accent shades that go over the base and on the base. Right now this accent shade goes over the base, so it has a little cord notch on the side. And all you do is put your accent shade over your simmering light, and you're good to go. Don't forget to add the sprinkles add first. Add the sprinkles though. first, <laughs> but of course, you can just put that over there. Again, you don't have to have sprinkles in there either. It's a good standalone decor piece, too. So this snowman's super fun, and we put him with our snowman, our snow family accent shade. This is one that's a smaller item, $25 item, so sits on the base. Again, very easy to put on. Put your sprinkles in your melting dish and then just put your accent shade over it and you're done. This one is very fun, $25 item made out of metal. 
It has the snow family on both sides. How cute is that? I want to call out too, the metal is actually bendable. So you can bend some of the items on here like the snowman scarf and really just give him some personality. So cute. And then in the back we have our winter day lantern accent shade. This one, I want to scoot this over so you guys can see it a little better. Go the other way. Other way. Hmm. There we go. So you this one Tucker. is so cute. So it's really funny. So Danielle um, developed this product. She designed it. And she has the cutest little dog named Tucker. And she put Tucker on not, there. Not so little. <laughs> He's a big dog. He's a big dog. But this Winter Day Lantern is really cute featuring a winter scene on it. You have a little dog with a hat and a scarf. And then the snowman is matching him. And then it has cutouts on top that are snowflakes and stars, really to allow the fragrance to throw, but also a very traditional piece. This is one item that you could have out after the Christmas season because it's not so Christmassy. So again, a great traditional item. And that one also, if you want to flip around, has, oh, I thought that one did have the same on this other side. My bad. <laughs> um, but like she said, has all those great openings. And so does this, the snowman simmer pot. The top of his top, his top hat is open which allows that fragrance to throw and it's not getting trapped into the accent shade. Right. So. And we paired this one with our purple textured simmering light. We did that on purpose just to show you guys something that is not seasonal, but also a more of a core item. This purple textured simmering light is so pretty and glows so cool. It's a little bit of a more modern piece, but again, you can layer it under our Christmas items, but you can also just have it as a standalone item without an accent shade over it. That it might be one of my favorite uh, simmering lights because it is such a great standalone and a good everyday. Just put um, the, the dish in there and pour some sprinkles in so they can, they can see us doing that. There you go. Every simmering light comes with a dish. So it's really easy. All you do is take your jar of sprinkles and then you just pour them in there. And because they're so Whoops. tiny, they literally melt in minutes. They melt in minutes. And start and we're going to start smelling this and y'all are going to be jealous. <laughs> smells so good, but they melt in minutes and then you're fragrancing your home. That's perfect. Thank you. You're Th welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the demonstration. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we got some more. We're actually finishing up, guys. We are on elf number <gasps> six. Um, elf number six is one horse open sleigh. Oh my goodness. Um, he <laughs> is known for creating Santa's sleigh that delivers all the toys every year, and he makes sure everyone knows of this accomplishment too. But who wouldn't? Right. If you create Santa's He's sleigh, pretty important you're job. kind of the coolest guy Just ever. He has lots of friends in that. He does. Yeah. But I mean, I'm sure all the elves do because they can't be without each other. Like, right. if you don't have the toy making elf and you they don't have a sleigh they making need each elf, other, they, right? each they other. depend on each other. They do. <laughs> so, <laughs> your one horse open sleigh. Oh, I love this fragrance, guys. This has vanilla and cardamom in it. And I want to talk a little bit about cardamom mm -hmm. because sometimes people are like, what really is that? Or what does that smell like? So, cardamom is a um, smoky spice aroma that gives the sensation of warmth and comfort. So it's not mm. the cinnamon, it's really a warm spice to it, giving you that feeling of that comfort, like I had said. But of course, created some recipes that what I'm gonna you share do? with you guys. So your elf number six, I created two recipes with this. The first one um, is kind of, I think is a no brainer because <laughs> I mixed it with Holiday Home. So your elf number six, one horse open Ooh. sleigh with Holiday Home and your Holiday Home Oh, guys, this is clove, cinnamon, spice, fir needles, sandalwood, vanilla. Tell me what I'm not missing in Christmas in this jar because so it's, it's here. So it's the color, perfect color. It's the color. perfect color. It's Everything. Per it's a you great guys table. really, it's Christmas in a jar. This I mean, one, just go ahead sure. and get yourself a carton of that. But make sure you also get elf number six, one horse open sleigh. Put those two together. It I smells like Christmas. What I call, call that rustic holiday. Oh, oh my goodness. We're going to have that. I just want to go put my Christmas tree up right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so then she does the same thing, like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> I already started decorating for Christmas last you weekend, did. guys. I picked up Halloween. You're like, oh, get I, out. Get out. Out with yeah. Halloween. And I had all my pumpkins, and then I was just like, oh, I don't know, like, 
she, mom was watching Hallmark movies, and I was like, <laughs> I might just want to do this. And I'm like texting Brittany, and I'm like, is this bad? She's like, no, I'm doing do it, it too. Do it, do <laughs> it. We, we had so much fun doing this set for you guys. I think it really yeah, got yeah. all of us in the Christmas spirit. We were playing Christmas music last week. All of our coworkers were like, y'all are crazy. What are you guys <laughs> doing? But we're having fun. I did. We, we did have fun. I had fun <laughs> last weekend, too. But um, So the second recipe, this is a very unexpected little blend that I created, but trust me, okay? okay. So what I did you. was your elf number six oh, with this one's caramel one. brittle. <laughs> Guys, this caramel brittle, brittle is a sweet, crunchy, um, salted caramel with hints of nutty vanilla. I love this fragrance. It's mm. not your um, gooey caramel. It is truly a brittle. crunchy, nutty caramel. Mm. Love I want to eat some now. Don't do that. I want to. Though. Then, <laughs> the second fragrance that I blended with this is your banana bread. Is exactly what it is. Your traditional banana bread, sweet baked bread, bananas, vanilla extract, brown sugar, molasses. These two are your core fragrances um, in your catalog that I use to blend with Elf Number Six. Your One Horse Open Sleigh. <laughs> Let me give this. It's so interesting. I love it. Let me it. smell. I know. I'm sorry. I don't need to share. You're being so a sprinkle I, hog. I am a sprinkle <laughs> hog. So I call this one Blitzen's Bakery. Oh, oh that's so that's cute. That's so cute. Thanks. That is a cute one. So for this last recipe, I can see people putting this into our more traditional, kind of more mm -hmm. modern home decor accessories, like our falling snow accent shade that they're about to pan over to. This is such a beautiful piece. Look at how pretty this one glows. The Falling Snow Accent Shade has been in our fall cat in our winter catalog for a couple of seasons, and we keep bringing it back because it's such a hit. Mm -hmm. The accent shade is made out of mercury glass that really allows for any simmering light to glow so beautifully. In there, we have candle glow that really just makes it glow very, very pretty. The accent shade actually sits on a base that you can see the wood, the, it sits on a wooden base that makes it a little bit more traditional, kind of modern, and then we took that detailing and put it on the top with the rope detailing and mm -hmm. added some pretty glitter and gold, silver snowflakes on there, oh, really just completing the look. And then the so rope pretty. at the end has those cute little bling snowflakes, turn it back around. Wait, do you see how those snowflakes sparkle? I love it. I'm going to knock this all over. Mm -hmm. Don't do that. It goes Don't all the way around. That. I know, I know, I know. I try, I try. I try, I, I try. try. But I look, try. too, these, like, little... And again, you don't have to have a summery light in there. It's a great just home decor piece. Sorry, I kind of showed that. But, but why would you not want to light that? But you have to, though. It makes it glow pretty. And then we paired that with our super cute little welcome bear woolly. Our woolies are another so just cute. as soaked item that we didn't show you guys earlier. I think Kel is going to show you how you use it. It's super easy. You just squirt soaks on it, and you can put that in any place where, you, again, you don't have a plug. Like, a lot of our consultants and customers put those in little kids' rooms. They don't want to put, you know, a simmer pot in there. So Something they put burning. a woolly. That's super cute little but decor, and it smells good. Yeah, and it's cuter than the sticks, you right. know, which the sticks are kind of fun, but it adds a little personality to the room. Yep. It does. Yep. And that Welcome Bear Wooly has been such a hit, a hit this season. I think that's an all year round it's, item. It, it is. Because that's your style of decorating right. for sure. If right. you have a rustic kind of lodgy decor. feeling decor, you can totally um, decorate all year long with that one. So yeah. very Super cute. Fun. Okay, cute. guys. Did we we do had this so much so fun, fun showing you these elves. We hope you guys love them as much as we did. And we had so much fun. We did. And together, these elves. Um, add jolly to the Christmas season and paired with great warmers and accents pieces um, there are so many decorating opportunities and gift opportunities um, there so there was so much that we have talked about um, so I want to quickly review what we went over so there is six Christmas elf special is available right now you guys this is an exclusive while supplies last promotion and you can shop on the Pink Zebra Home website or your consultants replicated website under the PZTV shopping tab um, to see all the products we went over today, not mm -hmm. just your elves. But everything. Um, everything. So there are six elves, and each elf is available in four different formats. You can see um, your sprinkles, your soaks, your super clean soap, and your four-pack mini hand sanitizers, as well as two great exclusive bundles for gift opportunities. Yeah. Um, super easy peasy. Super easy peasy. So we hope you guys 
had so much fun yes. with us. We had so much fun. We I had can't so believe much it's over. We no, have like not yet developing though. this. What? I mean, they've got to. They got to tell us what they think of this. Go to Instagram yes. and all that fun stuff. So right? actually, we're doing a fun giveaway on Instagram. So as soon as we're done, be sure to head over to our Instagram at Pink Zebra Home. And Paisley is doing a fun giveaway with all you fragrance lovers all over the world. Be yep. sure to tag us and the recipes you come up with or even the home decor that you're using to Paisley make your cute on little Christmas shelf. things. We want to see it all. Gotta like, see it. Share with us what y'all do. Show your decorating show ideas you do it. on the mantles and centerpieces. Yeah. Now Santa, Santa told me that he's got one more gift. What is she about what to do? What is she about to do? He wants to share. He what wasn't going to do it, but you know, he kind of does it and it's been here all <gasps> along. So I'm going to open this up. You're and I'm going to let me. you take that oh, off. You are not doing Surprise! this. Surprise! We're doing it. <laughs> so what we have here is one more exclusive set for you guys. This is our sweater reindeer simmer pot paired with a jar of sprinkles that's so super fun and cute. This reindeer is a little bit more modern. Again, the white design, and then we put we, we embossed a sweater yeah. print on it and just kept it very traditional red and white. These great sprinkles are so beautiful. We had to make it really fun, so of course we had to mix some red and green in there and just really making this set so fun and Christmassy. And that's available right look now. Look how cute, look and how cute his little reindeer ears. Did you the show this is his, that's, that's actually the dish. How cute, that's the dish. Yeah. And these so sprinkles, cute. I believe, are even called sweater weather. Like, how cute is that? I want to show, like, it's sometimes good to see, like, the size reference of this. We've never, oh, we're, like, playing back and forth with the camera right now. Um, but we've never, I don't think we've had, oh, we had the turkey that had the little, um, the dish had it on the, yep, the turkey was on the dish. So yeah. this is the same Kinda thing with the So this is 3D. Yeah. So, again, such a cute little Cute little gift. So fun. Cute little gift. Great gift. Thank you, Santa. That okay. was a nice little surprise. Thank you, Santa. <laughs> I think I think now that's it. Okay, that I don't know. That no, that's, it. It. that's it. So thank you guys and thank you so much for joining us and thank have a you. wonderful holiday. Happy season. holidays. Bye.